Good day guys, it's Jara here and today I thought I would kind of do like a little shopping haul, I guess. Don't know what to call it. This is just all the stuff I bought while I was in Phuket. And if there's anything I bought in Singapore, I will put it in at the end. I'm currently in Singapore, so yeah. So I thought I would just kind of film a little haul of things I bought. So first off, um, we were kind of just looking around because we wanted to see what Phuket had. And I found this really beautiful dress. So it's got a nice like, lacy part, if you can sort of see there. So you can make it as tight or as loose as you want. And then it kind of has this like ruched part here, so it cinches just under the bust. And it's a really nice flowy dress. I like the pattern of it, it's kind of like girly, but just really nice and comfortable and super soft and it was pretty cheap too. So I thought that was just a cute dress that I actually really like. So that's a positive. Next, um, these are two out of so I have three out of four of the ones I bought. So first, I bought this like knockoff Adidas crop top thing, uh, sports bra. It's really cute. It's comfortable. I like it, and I really love loved it a lot. I said, you know, it's good for swimming and all that stuff. So I bought three more. So there's just so that's an extra large. These are enlarged, so there's this one, which I haven't tried on yet, but it's really cool. I like that one. And I also got it in like a grey version of it. I liked this one because it reminds me of like water. This one kind of is like camo. I know you can see the Adidas there. And then the other one is up there. It's like a weird bluey colour. but. I really like those, super comfortable, they're not supportive, but they're comfortable, and that's all that matters, and they're great for swimming in. So next, to go with like the Adidas theme, because if you don't know, your girl loves Adidas. Um, she always, like, growing up, I always had Adidas sneakers, because they were the only sneakers that, for me in particular, were supportive enough for my feet, because I, if you didn't know, I had a lot of issues growing up with my ankles as a kid, so Adidas were the only sneakers that were first off were recommended to me by a foot doctor to wear but second of all were comfortable and supportive but also fit the school guidelines and look good as well so I've always just kind of been a fan of Adidas and they always have such a great collection of, clothes, of shoes so I bought these really cute super soft just like guys pants so I got those they're really comfortable they're like a tiny bit baggy but they're so soft, like they're so soft and I love that. So they're part of the like added ass family I bought. Now the next stuff I bought for my boyfriend. Um, because he said not to buy him anything. So I did anyway. Um I always like to buy myself friends. Always like to buy my friends and stuff now that I have a boyfriend. I'm still gonna buy him stuff, obviously. So I bought him Nike. Shorts, again, super soft, super comfortable, same as me. He doesn't know I've got this yet for him. And I just also got him this really simple, you know, just grey Nike t-shirt. I thought he could just lounge around in, or if he wants to, he can just keep it at my house. Really chill, really comfortable. It's as simple as that. So that's all the branded stuff, but another thing I did get him, I will show you. If I can reach it. So we went to this show called Phuket Fantasy, it's the ultimate culture theme park. So that's like their bag that they have. So it's um, it's kind of like how I would describe it is if Disneyland and Universal Studios combined it together and then brought in cultural information on Thailand. And it was actually really beautiful and it was quite fun. So I got to go on a elephant ride, so they gave us this. Like little coin purse thing which is really cute and then inside of this I found this guy who was hand made, hand made these beautiful like key rings and stuff like that and I was like can you make me one with this name in it so he handmade me this one 
So as you can see, it's a blue love heart, which is his favourite colour, and mine as well, with his name in it. So, I hope he likes it. If the camera can focus on me. Hello. Um, yeah, I just thought it was cute, something simple. He can put on his keys, and he can think of me while driving, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, I didn't want to go too over the top lovey-dovey. So I thought this was a cute little alternative. Alternative. Because apparently I have an accent now, so it's an alternative. Cool. Um, there's also photos and stuff of that that we got from the Phuket Fantasy Show, which is in the vlog that I did about Phuket. Go watch that if you haven't already. It's in a playlist. It'd probably be in the either over 30 minute playlist or under 30 minute playlist. It's in the all videos playlist. It's in the probably Sunday playlist, probably in the vlog one as well. I got a lot of playlists. I got a lot of things I do by myself. So yeah, it's in one of those. Now, just going back to clothing items. The same with the dress. I found these really cute shorts, which just give me a second because I've worn these a lot. Um, and they're inside out, so let's put them the right way. So there's just these. I was trying to find some shorts because I'm, if you know me, I'm a person who like doesn't like short shorts. I like long shorts, and they don't have to be ridiculously long, just enough to cover my butt and then some. Um, I have a thing with my legs and stuff, but I found these really cute shorts. You know, with the tight, like with the elephants all over them, and cute little tassels. As you can tell. They get kind of caught in the middle, in the crotch area, but not when you're walking, so that's pretty cool. But yeah, I just love the design of them. They're super comfortable and stretchy, and they're just really beautiful, and I like them a lot. Speaking of the elephant routes, or elephants on there, I bought my friends a bunch of elephants, so hopefully by the time this comes out, I've given them all, but if not, then they'll see it online anyway so I've got elephant one this is for my friend Casey who I love and adore her favorite color is yellow and she's a Hufflepuff like me so this one's for her with a cute little tassel butt and it's sitting which I thought was kind of cute because it's just like mm, it's a bit different to the rest so next we got the rolling bags because as you can see I bought a couple. So. <laughs> Yay! I just ruined one. No, 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 no. Oh, no, that makes me really sad. Oh. No. I was going to give this one to my brother. Well, this is for my brother anyway, um, it's beautiful and pretty and but the detailing was really nice on it and for me he could like, that makes me really sad. Mm. The next two are for my two best girlfriends in the entire world who I love and adore. So we got one for my best girlfriend, um, Bianca. So she loves purple right now, and I know she'll like this. And then I got this one for, again, my other girlfriend, Erin. Because, again, just super cute. Elephants mean a lot in the Phuket culture, so I got her, actually I got her this one, sorry. The other blue one is for my friend Shanna. Her birthday is coming up, so I'm going to give this to her for a birthday gift, as well as other stuff as well. I got myself this one. I like how small it is. It's just cute. I love all the designs and details on it. I So this one is a lot smaller compared to the rest as you can see. But I like it. It's just small. It's cute. It's just adorable and everything I like. So positive. Um, I got one for my dad as well. Um, which is in here. This one is for my dad or mum 
This is a spare one we got, but we just loved the like colors and we loved the detailing. So there's that one too. And that's all of the elephants. There's a lot of them, but I love all my friends and I didn't know what to get them. So I thought, why not give them elephants? They're really cute. I actually know that my brother's isn't ripped. I'm just blind. <laughs> it looks like it's ripped, but it's actually not. It's part of the design. So. Love you, brother. <laughs> but yeah, this is for him. Moving on from that, speaking of people I love and adore, um, so I got, well, my mum got this bag for my nunna because she does acrobics, which is like a swimming, it's fitness in a pool, pretty much. So we got her this bag. You know, it's just simple with cute elephant prints on it. And it's quite a large bag and it's got a long strap so she can put it over, put her keys in there and whatever else. And it's just got a nice little like wooden button so she can put it over like that. Or if that's too hard for her, there's a zip as well. And it's really cute and we thought she'd love it. This next item, yes you can see it's a scroll, I got it for my boyfriend's mum. Because I think she's an amazing woman and I wanted to get her something for her office or just something in general. So I'm just going to unroll it because it's kind of delicate. And this is a painting of a village. So as you can see here, this is all hand painted. There's a string in the way, I'm sorry. There we go. So... So as you can see, this is all hand painted and I wanted to get her something that was kind of, because she's a photographer like me, I'm not a photographer, but I like photography, um, and I thought this was kind of on the photography train, it's beautiful, so it'd be nice for her to hang up in her office. I personally love these type of, they're like old fashioned now, but they're like felt paintings, but you know, as you can like see, it's really beautiful and I love it. and. I think she'll really like it and I hope she does. Um, if not, then that's perfectly okay too. But there's all like golden flecks all through it and I think she will like it. Fingers crossed. She's not. I know no matter what I get her, she'll like, but that's just something I got her. Last but not least, if I can reach it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, another thing I got which I don't have with me because they're in the fridge is. Kit Kat milk tea I'm obsessed with like I bought five packets just to bring home ready aim one of the packets and we still I bought like five when we we're away realistically last but not least is if you know me you'll know that this is oh thank god it came up a big deal for me I am a huge collector of um what's it called I'm a huge collector of Snow globes. This is my one thing I like to collect. So I got this one because it's got cute little elephants in it. It's got the floating market written there, and it says Thailand. And I thought this was just beautiful to add to my collection. So I always grab one snow globe wherever I travel. That's my thing. I have so many of them, but I love them all so much. And you know, you can see all the little gold flecks through them. It's different to the rest that I have, so and I love it a lot. So it just goes in the box. I'm always paranoid that it's gonna break, so I always wrap it in things, but which I should do actually, so I'm gonna leave it out. But yeah, these are all the things that I've bought while in Phuket to give to friends and family and loved ones. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, let me know in the comments below and tell me if you guys liked any of them or if you guys would buy any yourself or which elephant did you like the best? Did you like the brown one? Did you like, you know, the yellow one, or the blue one, or you know, the green, or the little baby one, or the purple, oh, the purple one, or did you like some of the outfits, or art pieces, or whatever? Let me know in the comments below. Anyway, you're right, see you guys in the next video. Whoop! Sarcasm out. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. I hope all my friends like their gifts. There. They're really cute and I, yeah, I think they'll like them.
Fingers crossed. Yes.